quick pick up and play video. Um, I've already unwrapped it because um, it's only a single item. It's not in perfect condition but it's a game that I've been after for quite some time. Um, it being in what is one of the, supposed to be one of the best shoot 'em ups uh, for the Super Nintendo or S Super Famicom in this case. And it is a copy of Super Alest. Now as you can see the box isn't um, in the most perfect shape as far as colour is concerned. It's a little faded and it uh, is a little crushed on this side. It's not too bad. It'll, it'll straighten up over time. And whenever I get hold of some um, Super Famicom box protectors uh, that'll help a bit. But it's, it's still pretty good. It's in a box. Um, love the look of the screenshots. Can't wait to play this one. Um, and inside we have the manual. And we have the little registration card thingy. And the manu manual's in excellent condition. Um, let's be the one page. There we go. As you can see, the manual's in really good condition. And the cartridge is um, not too bad. A little bit of a yellow back, but the front of it and the label is perfect. Just got a little bit of yellowing on the back there, but that's not going to hurt anything. I'm not too fast. Um, I more, you know, really want to play this game and looking forward to it. Um, and um, yeah, I've been after it for a while. I had a, a watch on Super Alest on my um, eBay thing for quite some time. Um, and I've bid on a, quite a few of them on the eBay auctions, but um, have never been lucky until now. And this copy uh, wasn't too expensive. Um, I can't remember much I'm paying for it now, but it's um, probably about half the price they've been going for lately. So I think between 30 and 40 or something like that. Um, so I'm pretty pleased at getting it, especially a box copy, loose copies go for that a lot of the time at the moment. Uh, there's a lot of competition for shoot 'em ups. I said, it's just a game that I've really wanted to play for quite some time. So I don't know how I'll go with the gameplay because I haven't had a game of it yet. Um, and I don't know what all of the, um, the different weapon power-ups do. So we'll have to see how I go. Alright, let's go do that now. Right, so here we go with Super Alest. I said I've been looking forward to getting hold of a copy of this game for quite some time. Just let the intro load. Um, and I haven't really done that many Super Nintendo or Super Famicom gameplays. Now, we'll say this, I'm playing this on my um, PAL Super Nintendo with um, a, an adapter cartridge. Works for most games, just not all of them, so obviously won't quite play at the same speed as normal. The intro's longer than I thought. It's only a single gameplay though, so complaining that I just kicked her out of a chair to do this video. Yes, learning a lot about the Nint uh, Super Nintendo at the moment. Um, as I'm doing some development for it. Quite powerful graphics chip. Very slow processor. You definitely have to learn how to get everything uh, organised. So here we go, here's the proper title. Very good at doing things like transformations, like that title and things like that. No, so, alright, let's get into it. I've wasted enough time. Um, I'm just going to play a normal game and see how far I go. I don't even know the buttons. There's a bomb. <laughs> so you, the whole idea of a less is you pick up secondary weapons, so I'm currently on three. It's the only thing I don't know. I haven't played. Um, I can oh, shoot it before. So. It's also the wrong one. And then you power up each one of the weapons by picking up the orbs. So some of the weapons are like. And as with most less games, they're not too hard, as long as you well, start with anyway, they get hard. 
And also another thing that eases you in as well is they usually have um, um, sorry, that's not bad. That goes in the direction you're, you're facing. Move, sorry. Um, it's not one hit death, basically. Okay. Shall we see what vibes like? So we've got missiles. And then we actually took quite a few hits. long stage
That same weapon this time. So what do I do? I miss. Oh, that five must be the level of power. Up. So I didn't show you a Superman of the game, but um, it's it, it's a game where you you feel like you're making progress. So 358, 200, probably not a high score at all, um, but a really really good game that I'm thoroughly looking forward to discovering more of the levels. Um, love the LS games. Um, I've played heaps of the MSX ones that I have. Um, and they're also the uh, the Star Soldier series is very similar as well, and of course Gunhead on the um, PC Engine. So I've loved those ones. Don't have Gunhead for the original NES yet. Bit of an expensive game that one. I haven't been lucky, so just glad to get this um, game for a reasonable price. And um, it's actually nice getting only the one game, so I can focus on it for a little while. All right, I'm Electric Adventures. Thanks to all my subscribers, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.